Now I'm going to show you how to easily reach the Zoom application that is pre-installed. Or if you don't have it installed, just check first in your applications the IT Restore where you will where will be visible all the applications that you have available for download or update. In this case, you can check for Zoom and I already have installed. Otherwise, you will have the option to install it directly and it will be a process very fast to have your application available. Once you have it in there, just make sure to select the application and then the Zoom software will be feasible for you. Once there, it is as easy as just join a meeting and select the meeting ID and, and use the code if required and you will be joining into the session. So if you want to share your screen, just make sure to use the share icon and screen and immediately you will be displaying all the information that you have on the panel. So everything that you perform into the meeting will be visible for all the people. And if you switch to, for example, the browser, uh, now everything is visible for all the people. And even the annotations that I can do here with the annotate option, with the highlighter and everything, the captures and so on, everything can be just displayed here directly. So it is very convenient for you to have this option. Make sure to shut down if you want to continue, check for the information. And and of course, if you want to stop the screen share, uh, you always have this option in the floating toolbar on Zoom in the lower left corner, where you also have the annotations with R in both ways, or are just the annotations from Zoom. So this ink also will be recorded and visible if you record this session, right? Uh, so I'm going to just stop the screen share. And now what we will have here is is just the information visible for you, for everyone uh, now in the main webcam. So thank you again for watching this video series, for taking the most advantage of your iTree Touch panel.